Sexies, what's good? Welcome back to another video. You already know what time it is. It's Steven Universe. We're um we're back with the three packs because last week um we were doing twos and this week we're doing threes. I know it's starting on a Wednesday, but it's because one of these weeks I had missed a day. So the next three videos will be three packs. So hopefully you guys do enjoy these. If you want to see these uncut, unedited, link in the description to the Patreon. You can catch it um there earlier than youtube like i said uncut no black bar no edits none of that you can just watch the whole thing with me if you want um thank you guys for like all the love and support time like i don't know stuff has been a little like rough for me not super rough but like it's just been i don't know stuff's been like getting to me lately and like i love seeing the love and support from y'all because it does like um definitely like help me out and makes me feel like a little bit positive i don't want y'all to think nothing's like going on but like, i don't know lately i just been feeling like annoyed bro i'm just being completely honest with you i've been feeling annoyed with like a lot of stuff i think it's because like i'm stressed and i'm doing a lot of stuff so thank you so much for the love support thank you for understanding hopefully you guys do enjoy this i enjoyed these especially episode two you'll know it when you see it and um yeah hopefully you enjoy catch you guys in the next one i haven't really seen steven and connie together in a minute at least i don't think we have i just gotta lock him up lock him up how are you gonna lock lion up boop boop okay yeah, you're gonna come back, you're gonna be gone already. Favorite thing. Bro, I used to love libraries. Back in the day when I was young, I used to love libraries. I used to love reading, bro. Like, I kinda miss that. I ended up writing a very uh erroneous paper about raccoons having Erroneous? I don't even know what that means, bro. Erroneous dang coming. Yeah, I used to love um I used to love reading. There's this one wow. series I used to like. It was called like Bone. I think it was called Bone. I don't know. It was this white like character, like like literally like white. And he, I don't know if he was a bone or what. I used to like reading that. I used to like reading. Oh, there was more stuff. I can't think of it, bro. There's a lot more stuff I like. Bone was definitely up there though, cause like, yeah. Oh, I can't think. If I think of it, I'll let you guys know. But like, if you know Bone, like just know like yeah, we can we can be friends. Thank you. I need to read more, Whoa. man. <gasps> Ooh, Connie! it's a book about the crystal gems. Look! It's blank. He helped the first mayor Dewey discover Beach City. Oh, that There's dude. Gem locations in here. Oh. oh my gosh. Forget homework. Dang. She top. said, for, yeah. like, just do all that. Doom. Captain William Dewey they really got him narrating it, buddy. bro. Founded the land of Beach City. I shan't die a lowly first mate. I shan't die. I will do something. I will. <laughs> I'll comb the world in search of greatness. And or should I say, a field of swords. Oh, this is this is Rose's uh, as big as one's spot head. or whatever. Could have wielded such a weapon. The deep concentration. So it was he was around whenever the war was going on. Oh, it was Garnet. Salutations. It was two. Of is this real like so, i wonder this has to be real right because they're reading that book so this is exactly what happened they just portraying it as jamie and that's probably why they have the crystal gems looking that the age that that they are right now i guess not age the way that they are right now so this actually happened it's just portrayed like differently um what was i gonna say so yeah this happened because i was kind of confused whenever they did that that play episode with uh like mayor dewey and everything I was confused on whether or not that was happening during the war. And I think it was, or at least after the war. Yeah, it had to be after the war. The war happened before. Because this is the aftermath, I believe. The gems have looked different back then? Yes. Oh, well, there Definitely. we go. They're changing up their look. The oh, gems. my God. <laughs> Wait! There are many places on Wait. this earth that a human like you should avoid. Here is a convenient marking of all the places where you should absolutely under no circumstances visit. Fare thee well! Look at the bike, bro. <laughs> if I do explore these places, I'll be remembered as brave and courageous. Oh, so that's how he found Beach City. He's going there because they told him not to. Oh, this is where a giant lady was doing her thing. Yeah, What's Steven's been place? to all these spots. I don't know this one. Ooh, we haven't been there. Yeah. Looks like he went to the kindergarten. He went to, to, okay, to the kindergarten. I found Dang, he was out here exploring, bro. Why would they show him that? Mm. Showed him where not to go just so he could go. Are here. Hey, buddy. What? This is Buddy speaking. Is Amethyst? 
<laughs> Do you was she a crystal gem at the moment? She had to be because the, the battle was already over, right? Nowadays, I just come back every so often to see how the fam's doing. And you're just following someone else's footsteps. And here I was. Claiming to be a so that's why he's gonna go look and find Beach City because he didn't explore really anything. Right oh my God, relax, <laughs> bro. Oh yeah, why don't you try and find the sand castle? Uh, what? Sand castle, isn't that where they found lion? Thank you for your help. Yeah, okay. Right. Come back anytime, but not too much. This episode is weird, bro. I get what they're trying to do with this, this episode, but it's just weird. Ten days now. If this will be the last thing I ever see as I expire, an angel and her. Oh, it's a bunch of lions. It's Rose. Does she have a bunch of lions? She had a Became bunch of lions. Of a large figure in the shape of a giant woman. The ringlets of her hair. It's Rose. Oh, I didn't think we were gonna get back. like. Like I guess I don't know. Roses. By her pack so where's Lion Lion? Seven lions. <laughs> so we're gonna figure out what, what she's doing with these lions and stuff. Like what brings you out Those here, Rose? Was made on a ship, but we found land. Deserts for weeks, and there's been no sign of one. Would that be a sign of one? That's it. Bro, this dude could just look left, this. bro. I've got to. Of course, this. You sought for me. That's all. I'm you doing. said eat me, bro. No, no, that's not true at all. Sure, all these places have been explored before, but they haven't been recorded so intimately as they have. That's also journey. true. Yeah, no it one else is recording it too. So look at Rose, bro. Rose putting so people onto the their destinies, bro. Not even just gems, putting them. everybody onto their destinies. I get it. The, the Buddy Budwick Library. <laughs> nah, Jamie Me Cole, too. bro. That was a cool episode. I mean, it. I just wonder what Rose was doing out there and what's the significance of the lions and all that stuff, bro. I have so many questions about this show and there's only literally like two seasons left. So it's like, am I going to get these questions answered? I don't know, bro. I hope I do, bro. I really do. Lovely. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Tell me that's a bald cat, bro. Steven, what happened, bro? And why does Connie seem so distracted? You mad about something? <laughs> okay oh god oh, thank you okay oh i'm glad that was a joke just yourself what's going on connie man going to sit in. she's very excited to see you fight as stevani oh, oh they're gonna have to fuse Fusion training. oh they're not gonna be able to fuse some her head ain't right right now yeah they're not gonna be able to do it i can tell two pearls oh yeah because pearls can yeah 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 Well, they fused. Okay. I stand corrected. I stand corrected. All right. They fused. Is it going to last long? What the? Oh, the floating. You can still use his powers and stuff. Nice. Stevani's got floating powers. Huh? I'm sorry. Wait, what happened? Something happened with Connie and like that boy or something that she just saw. Something's going on with Connie. I wonder what it is. Well, she sound like be mean to somebody with accident? Happened? I beat someone up. What? A kid I didn't know. My training instincts kicked in. I just reacted. She beat him up? Oh my god. Bro, imagine, bro. Hey, Connie, can I borrow a boom, boom? Like, just, damn. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. All right, yeah. Well, that will that will make you um, feel some type of way for sure, bro. Definitely. Um, yeah, I wanna I'm gonna I'm gonna hear Connie's like thoughts on it and, and how she feels now. That's so wild. Yeah, but the fact of the matter is, she did, bro. You hurt people by accident. But you at least apologize. Try not to think about it. Hold the phone. Oh, Garnet, hold. Her heard. Is this gonna be? Clearly? Is this gonna be that the song? But first. We'll need Stevani. Is this, is this gonna be that one song we heard? The um gosh, I know what I'm talking about. The song. I think it is. I hope it is. Listen to the waves and let them fade away. Uh oh, she's starting to rhyme. Here comes Here comes the thong! That's what it is. Let's go. Okay. 
I just gotta let everyone know who's new. I've heard this song already. I've heard this song already. Um, this is one of the show, one of the songs that someone recommended before we even started Steven Universe. So before you get mad, like, ah, why'd you listen to this song? Like, if I didn't listen to this song, I wouldn't have gotten into Steven Universe. I wouldn't be watching the show right now. That's just how it worked. Okay, so I heard this song already. But now having the context, knowing who these characters are, originally I thought this character was Steven's mom because of the nose. I'm like, oh, that has to be like Steven's mom or something. So now having the context, knowing the characters and everything, it's going to hit a little bit different. It's going to hit a little bit different. Flexibility, you love and trust. Uh, let's go. This song is fire, bro. Best song of the season, probably. Uh, 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 uh. This song is so fire, bro. This might is this a top no 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 I'm not even gonna say is this this is a top three song in Steven Universe and I haven't even heard every song bro that's how confident I am in this song bro I haven't even heard every song the only songs I heard were the songs before this that we watched in the show and whatever we watched before watching Steven Universe I'm still confident this is a top three song it's that good bro it's that good she's showing uh Garner showing them the times where, like they were not in sync and stuff I love this. Now knowing the context and everything, I love this. Bro. Think about it. Take a moment to ask yourself, is this how we fall apart? And I'm thinking that's what like Ruby did. Like, hey, is this how we fall apart? No, nah, it's not. It's not. Let me go. Let me go talk to her about it. Let's go. You know, let's go. Um, Let's go mend this or whatever. And Lou Stevani singing. But yeah, she does get a verse or they do get a verse. Yeah. See, I, I, I thought at the time, I didn't know what, I remember watching this. I'm like, what the heck is going on? At first I'm like, is that her, is that her boyfriend? Is that, like, I, I was so confused. And then when you see right here, she's about to like slam him. I was like, or I think she slammed him. But I was like, yo, like I was so confused, bro. But now knowing what's going on, this makes a lot more sense. Dang, bro. That wasn't that wasn't that bad. That wasn't that bad. But yes, it, I think it got worse because she ran away. And I understand why she ran away. Like she did that. She was overwhelmed with everything. I think it could have been a little because like dude didn't like dude like he had tears in his eyes, right, little dude. But like he didn't run away. He just like he just went like this, like yo, like so. She would have been like, oh my god, like I'm sorry. Explained herself. Maybe it would have got better. But yeah, the fact that she ran away, I feel like it made. And then, like, it was just in her head at that point. It was, like, dwelling on it the whole time. That's, that's how a lot of things happen in, like, you know, everyone's life. Like, you be thinking about what you could do. Because, like, you didn't. I think that's awesome. But, yeah. Okay, but overall, it's not as bad as I thought. It, it's, it's, how do you say it? Reconcile, reconcilable? It's fixable. It's fixable. Just gotta, uh, she's gotta go talk to him, bro. She gotta talk to him. I think apologies in order for one. And yeah, I wonder why she was so on edge though. Something must be going on. Something else must be going on for her. Like someone just to tap her and her just be like, ah, boom, you know, like gotta be something's going on mentally. Okay, uh, look okay, at him getting in sync, okay. the, the breathing. Come on, man. It's all good. Kind of, you don't worry about it. I'm Stuff here, happens. I'm here, I'm and Steven's here, here right? He got you. Oh, look at him. All four of them. Oh. The love fusions, the fusions that are fused from love. What if all four of them fused right here? Well, no, 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 they can't. Could? Well, no, because the because because Connie's there. I was gonna say, what if they all fuse? Steven can fuse with Connie because he's part human. He can also fuse with any other gem because he's part gem. But I don't think they could fuse with Connie. I don't think that would be a. Yeah, I don't think that's a. I don't think all four of them could. I talked to Jack. That's his hey. name, by the way. Oh, you broke his arm? Tough. I apologized and he understood. Wait, good he job, Connie. Come on. I spent all that time feeling bad instead of doing something. It's like Bro. I was trying not to think about it. Mm -hmm. What did I say? I don't just be talking for no reason. I know what I'm talking about. Why scoot, bro? I'm literally Mabel from Gravity Falls. Listen to me. Everything I say is right. That was a joke. But um, yeah, no, that's exactly it, bro. She spent all this time worrying about something instead of doing something. That's what I said, bro. That's that's the stuff that'll eat you up, bro. And all you have to do is just like 
address your problem, bro. It's it's easier said than done, a thousand percent. But I don't know, bro. I'm a little I'm a little smarter and wiser now, and I just know, like I don't know. I should be I don't know. I should practice what I preach because, like I was telling y'all the other day, if you watched the Gravity Falls video, um, or on Patreon, I was saying like, yo, I like, I have this mental block when it comes to recording for some reason. Don't know why, because like I said, I thoroughly enjoy everything we watch. For some reason, I have a mental block where I'm like, I don't feel like watching this right now. And it's like, and then I spend the whole day worrying like, oh, dang, bro, like I should have watched it. If I would have watched it two hours ago, I would have been done already. And it's like, bro, instead of just thinking about it the whole time, just go, you know, address your problems, bro. Go do it. Come on, y'all. These there, there, there be lessons in here, bro. You just got to be looking out. The butterfly. What's that about? Yeah. So is it Steven now? It's Steven, yep. Oh, no. Yep. They've got this. Nah, Garnet taught them, bro. They can do this. Oh no. Jasper. Yeah, Steven's going through it right now. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be. He's thinking about all the things that he didn't do right. It's okay to think about it. Don't unfuse, y'all can do it. Oh, my dukes. Oh, no, he backed off the edge. Or they backed off the edge. I bet I keep saying he or she because I'm thinking about who's doing that at the moment. What? No, I feel bad when Steven starts crying. Yeah, bro, it's just real, bro. It's real. It's real emotions. You can't hide it, bro. It's okay to think about it. It's okay if it makes you feel bad. Like, it's just, it. it is what it is. That's what makes you human, bro. And you're part human. So, you know, embrace that, bro. I saw this for anything in, like, bro, Steven Universe. Mm, my God, bro. Mm. My goodness. Float, float, float. They're floating, right? Yep. Good job. I'm here. I'm here. Uh, oh, this is cold. Cold episode. Cold episode. Fire episode, bro. The song. Here comes a thought. Come on, stop playing, bro. Top three in Steven Universe, and it might not be three, man. Um, these episodes are getting like really deep. They're going deep into like Steven and like how he feels about everything like that's been going on, bro. Um, yeah, like, I, I, I honestly kind of knew he felt this way about stuff, but I guess he wasn't thinking about it at the moment. So, like, it was just, like, whatever. Now that he's thinking about it, it starts getting to him. But just like Garnet and just like Connie was telling him, like, bro, like, you know, it's okay. Think about it. Feel it, bro. Be, be you. Don't hide it. Don't bottle it up. Because you're never going to get past it if you just try not to think about it. So, yeah. I like this episode a lot, bro. And hearing Here Comes the Thought while having, like, more context now. It, it it moves it up that much uh further for me as far as like um songs because it just makes more sense and it hits like it hits harder now so i like that episode a lot bro Is zoltron that, that looks like y'all probably gonna be like yo yeah it is that bro thinking of the name but i don't know the name of it but the thing from power rangers bro Either the thing from Power Rangers or the Jetsons or so I'm seeing something here that I'm familiar with. And I think it might be like the Jetsons or Power Rangers, but yeah, yeah, it's something. Future. I just been dying to know. Why don't you go ask the Garnet, bro? You used to be a comedian? Yeah. What has this man not done, bro? He's done everything in entertainment. I'd rather not talk about it. You can do it, buddy. Dang. I just gave him a little tab. A little tab? Do you know how expensive this machine was? No way this machine was expensive, bro. They don't even work, bro. He's gonna make him be Zoltron. Man got oven mitts on, bro. All you wanna do is work. Let's go. Fetch me a quarter and I'll find your fortune. I'd be like, Steven, that's you, bro. That's literally Steven's voice. Even though Lars won't admit it, he really <laughs> likes to do a good job. Look Letting at him, him, bro. Him fills his heart with warm feelings. Is it weird that it knows our name? This man just dissected yeah, them, bro. Just dissected you them. You want to go to work? Yeah, let's. Zoltron sees prison bars in your future. <laughs> 
<laughs> I can see that. I can see that. <laughs> wow! Onion. I really feel like I'm making a positive change in people's lives. Are they paying you for it? Yeah, yes, you getting paid. Give him. Up, nah, give him a cut, sure. bro. Was it a mistake to come here? Zoltron What's up with this dude, bro? What's up with dude, bro? Will talking to him make any difference? Any difference at all? Tell me the truth. Do I really just drive everyone around me away? Zoltron Sorry for Steven to say anything. He doesn't even know him. For today are 16, wow. 47, and w. What the Even heck? Coins don't want to be around me. What's up with Poor dude? Guy. I wish I knew what to tell him. If only I could see into the future like Garnet can. I knew you'd say that. Garnet. Ah, Garnet, bro. Anytime you need her, bro. She's there. Uh, yeah. Really, Garnet? That's surprising. That should last a little while. Try to be home in time for dinner. Thanks, Garnet. What? Handing over the future vision? Garnet is like amazing, bro. She's amazing. Sadness in your future, no matter what you do. That sounds about right, Mr. Smiley and Mr. Frowny. You're Mr. Here to Smiley? See Mr. Smiley? Oh. Mr. Right, Mr. Smiley, Mr. Frown. Oh. He probably did stand up with him. At Mr. Frowny. What? He's in town, but he didn't seem very funny. Actually, that was the point. Was really depressing. I feel like maybe that, that was the point. Bit. Yeah. At least I thought it was, but. Oh, future wow. vision. Funny running into you. Of course, I'm still a punchline, aren't I? He takes hey, like, bro. He, wow. I don't know what's You're up great. with dude, but like. That's your best joke yet. He like yeah, nothing's good enough, bro. Is he, that he... all you have to say? You said he was getting on a bus. Yeah. I'm kind of curious about this, bro. Like, even though I don't really care about Mr. Smiley or whatever, but I want to see this. Just wanted you to take it seriously. And I just wanted you to have fun. Oh, I see. They so weren't they weren't agreeing work. on, like, what to do. You having a bad day, Frowny? Horrible. Well, why this is part of their act. Outside? The sun always cheers me up. But it blew away. This is part oh, of their act, you yeah. Must have been shocked. Yeah, that's when the lightning hit me. <laughs> oh. Oh. I thought there was something else up with him. Like, it was kind of keeping me well, out at first. I guess my debt is repaid. Steven, that machine costs thousands of dollars. Zoltron sees cramped legs. Hey, come on, bro. Future. There's no, there's no price for, for happiness, man. That was an interesting episode. We got a freaking Mr. Smiley episode. I didn't think we would get that. I know I'll be saying that about every side character, but there's one I would not think that we were going to get. It would probably be him, bro. Who have we not gotten yet? I want to say we've gotten every character. Sour Cream. We got the, the trio of uh them. The trio of the cool kids. We got the Fridemans. Both of them. We got Mr. Smiley. We got Onion. Unless we missing somebody, we got Jamie, we got like, you know, I don't know. I don't think we're missing anybody. I think we got all the side characters at this point. Um, It was cool, though. It was cool. I was more interested in it. I thought it was going to be that whole Mr. Frowny thing was interesting. I thought it was going to go a different direction. I didn't think he was there for Mr. Smiley, but um, it was still cool to see, though. And Steven got some of the Garnet Future Vision. I love that she can do that, bro, that she can like give him some of that. That's pretty cool, bro. It's just like Steven using his healing spit, but like... I don't know if she can do that. Like, that's, that's dope, bro. That's dope.